It's the Arberg Hotel and Cafe. Okay, and we got, I got a cappuccino, croissant to go with our dinner, or <laughs> dinner breakfast, and Matt got an Americano. And this is the view. Oh, well that truck's gonna block me in. But how nice is this? And it's only a couple minute walk from our Airbnb. We got a scrambled egg plate and then French toast. Oh, it's so good. Gosh. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Just finished breakfast. It was amazing. The French toast was so good. And probably one of the best I've had in my life. Also, that's filling up water. And then I think next stop is we're gonna go to the Hardacoon. But we might miss the first one, so I think we're gonna go up the second um I don't know, real gondola. gondola thing. So, yeah. Anyways, that breakfast was 10 out of 10, so good pick, Matt. Thank you. <laughs> Delayed response. Yeah, I was looking at this cute little buggy thing. Yeah. It's like a one person car. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> I'll see it. Anyways. It's like a glorified go kart. Yeah. The um, coffee shop we went to was like a few minute walk to our Airbnb, so that was another plus to it. Yeah, this. Uh, so we're in Interlaken, but we're in this Untersein mm -hmm. neighborhood, which is like very cute, tiny, um, quaint. quiet. Yeah. Yeah, it's great. We love it. There's like just a bunch of little shops and it seems like a lot of locals around uh -huh. here. Um, so yeah, check it out if you're in the area for sure. Yeah, a little more off the beaten path. <laughs> and much less uh, like touristy, commercialized like, yeah. you know, McDonald's, whatever other restaurants you're gonna find. Millions like the, the tourist shops. trappy restaurants. <laughs> yeah. Right. Just got done with breakfast, now we're gonna walk along this river to Hardikum. But how long? A uh, 15 minute walk. 15 minute walk, From so. From Winterstein to the gondola. And this is the view all along the river. So nice. Okay, made up the funicular. Now we're walking to Hardikum, and here's the view. On our way up. Which is amazing. Amazing, exactly. See the lake over there. That's uh. And then the other one. Yeah. Oh, and here it is. You can see the sign. Also love these little sculptures. Amazing. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, it's Lake Tune. Uh huh. And Lake Brienne's. There you go. Oh, and you can see up here. There's a little lookout you go to. So I think we're gonna head in that direction. Doesn't look as nice with the construction. Yeah, really. The view from the platform, amazing. I'm like so scared to drop this. <laughs> this is all of interlocking. Mm -hmm. So which part's which? Um, oh, there's that big park we were at last night. Yep, so that's the big park where everyone paraglides into. Uh -huh. Over here is Untersein on this side of the water. And then from that side of the water, all the way across to there is Interlaken. So this is where, like, by Interlaken, what? Untersein, that's Interlaken West, and that's East. The east. Uh -huh. Oh, you see that, like, foggy <laughs> haze of, like, uh -huh. a misty cloud? That looks crazy. Yeah, that cool. Okay, here it is. Iger, Monk, Jungfrau. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Feels so good up here, the breeze. And you can go up here for sunset, which I feel like would be super nice. It's already pretty busy though. View, and they have a restaurant up this, here too. This whole view right here with the water and the mountains is insane. Mm -hmm. walking from train station and we walked upon this little pond kind of by Hotel Interlaken. It's got little crayfish in it. It's super cute. It looks like a cow. Yeah. Oh, and there's a duck. There's so many different colors. And you just like wander and you never know what you're gonna find. But I think we're gonna do a little souvenir shopping and then take a boat at noon to 
It's a vlog. Is that how you say it? Yeah, your guess is as good as mine. I it's, think that's it's a vlog. Yeah. Yeah. And that's our plan. Did a tiny bit of shopping. Didn't get anything. Window uh, shopping. Yeah, window shopping. Because then we hurried back to our Airbnb and changed because it feels hot today. Yeah. So we changed and now we're speedily walking back to in like an Ost train bus station area because that is where the boat takes off. So we're gonna head there. We might pop into the co-op store and get a little drink and snack for the boat ride. Cause I think it'll take about an hour to get to it's still wall it's evolved it's, it's evolved it's evolved so we're just speed walking now because we have like a 22 minute walk and then I'll probably talk to you guys once we get on the boat all right so we loaded up on snacks and we are now ready to board this boat and take it around Lake Brienne and then uh, to it's so we will show you more on board I see the lake. Mm -hmm. Just made it to Itzevald mm -hmm. and we don't have any agenda. We're just gonna <laughs> walk around and explore. Seems like a cute little mountain town. We'll go some water. Okay. And you can get here by boat or bus, but we wanted to really want to take a boat ride, so that's why we took the boat. And I think it took about an hour, maybe less. And the boat ride was really nice, so. And we also packed lunch and had that, which was surprisingly good. We got some random sandwich and bowl from Coop. Actually, I just realized, is it Coop or is it Coop? I was just wondering the same thing. <laughs> I don't know, it's one or the other. So, just gonna explore around here and show you guys what we get up to. That is a really nice view. We just made wish. We saw what are these called? Dandelions? Oh yeah, they're dandelions. But yeah, blowing it making a wish. Okay, so we're doing a little walking. And then here is the castle. I'll zoom in on it. Do you know what the name of it is, Matt? Um it is Schloss Schloss Seeberg. Cute. But it had a private gate, so can't really like walk up to it. <laughs> yeah, we're just walking around exploring. It's a really cute little small town. You know what I'm thinking of? When we were saying castle, I was thinking of the castle ruins that I think are by Interlaken. I was getting that mixed uh, up with this. Yep. Yeah. Because yep. you can actually walk up to that. Yep. I'm assuming you can't walk up to this because it looks pretty, uh, Secl pretty secluded, secluded or what? and like together. Oh. <laughs> Not like ruins of the yeah, castle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But. Can't get over how blue this lake is. You can't even tell on the camera, but it's just so nice. Okay, I love the fact that Switzerland just has so many kitties. Oh, what do you see, kitty? Oh, you see, you see something, look at him. Look at that tail, <laughs> it's so cute. Cute little restaurant, cafe yeah. on the water. Salad, breakfast, pizza. It's adorable. That's, that's the thing, every place serves pizza here. There is pizza every everywhere. <laughs> this is so fun. This is so fun. <laughs> oh, look at this perfect just, shady spot. Oh my gosh, yeah. Do um, do yes. have silverware? I'll go grab some. Okay, thank you. Okay, where? I'm not even sure what it's called, but look at this view. It's a cute little terrace area, and we're both trying the Hugo drink, which I know it has Prosecco, mint. I'm not sure what else, but it sounded good. What's all in the drink um it is prosecco elderflower syrup mint and seltzer water yum and then we got this which was i can't remember what it was called a creme either. torte yes and it just looked amazing i haven't seen something like it so why not try it okay cheers first cheers. piso i've seen this a lot on the menu but we haven't tried it yet this is my first time i've seen it mm -hmm. 
Oh, that's really good. That's really good. That's deadly. Nice and refreshing. Very refreshing, and we're gonna try this. We're gonna do a first bite. I would love to. Lots of stuff like whipped cream and cream here. Mm -hmm. Is it good? Mm hmm. It's very good. I'm just gonna angle this on the ashtray. <laughs> this lighting's like crazy. Oh, I see. You can't help but let it smoosh out. Oh, there's a big bee right here. Sorry. Good, right? It's so like a cream puff times two million, way better. That's how the seal of approval. It starts shaking and, and, not, and nodding. Up. Yeah. 10 out of 10 recommend. I can't, I don't know what the place of this is called. Um, it's an It's Evolved and it's hard to miss. Hard to miss. And I showed on the video what it looks like. So now we're going to enjoy our little snack before we head back to Interlock. Interlock. Okay, we just had our little Hugo cocktails and that dessert. Which is like cream tort something. Amazing. One of the best desserts, best desserts I've ever had. Now we're just walking back to wait for the boat. boat. Cause it should be coming in like less than 10 minutes. And then back to interlocking for the rest of the evening. On the road, I've been around the floor. Rooftop, sliding doors. Just wanna know you more. I hope you wanna be this on that. Spending all the The view she could see her building Try to tell her I know I feel it Keep me flowing when I'm on my bed Slow me down when I'm living fast Now at Velo Cafe and Bar And Matt got a Vanilla latte And then I got a caramel Just so we could try them both Taste test It's good Tasty. Play a small little cup. That's good. Let me try yours. I mean, it's alright actually. Yours better. Oh, yours better. Alright, try. Here. Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Do a little souvenir shopping. You're in the background. In my head. Are you okay? Okay, we got this shirt to share because I like to wear oversized shirts and the oversized is Matt's size. So we got this interlocking shirt, which is a nice, cute color. And then we got gifts for people. So I feel like I can't show that in case my family watches this. But actually, maybe by the time. No. I can't show you in case my family watches it, but Matt got his dad and brother this little interlocking poster. Cute. Oh my gosh, the name of that shop was The Woodpecker. You can shop it at www.woodcarvings.ch.com or <laughs> added.com. I can't show you. Some of these are gifts for family, but I did buy this because I saw it in another town. I really liked it. Sorry, I have to unravel it. Because these are all fragile items. And I got this. Little pressed flowers from Switzerland. And it has interlocking on it. So I thought that was really cute. And that is all. Which this is like the first... Are these the first souvenirs we've gotten? This whole trip? Uh, yeah. I think they are. Yeah, I don't think we've gotten anything else. Anyways, so I think we're gonna chill for a minute, relax, freshen up, and then we're gonna walk around a little more and then probably get dinner and then we have to pack up again because we have a early morning tomorrow heading to Italy. So yeah, now I'm gonna chill because my feet hurt. <laughs> Cheers. Alright, so we're back at the brew house of this brewery I was trying last night. Mm -hmm. and this is the best beer I've had in Switzerland. Good. Mine's really good too. It's um barrel brewing passion guava. It's delish. Okay, we went to what was that place called? It was 
beer house? Oh something God, beer like, house. That's like emerged from the shadows. I know. Ooh, that's spooky. Creepy. It was something beer house. I will help you out in a minute. Anyways, we got um burgers. We got a chicken sandwich. Uh, it was had coleslaw buffalo and chicken. buffalo chicken. Buffalo chicken sandwich. It was pretty good. And then we also got like a normal burger. And Not a normal burger. Well, Swiss burger. A Swiss burger. With Swiss cheese. Onion strings. Onion strings. I just realized I didn't even taste the onion strings. We went to house. Who's beer house? Hoosie. Hoosie. Hoosie beer house. Um, might not be pronouncing that correctly. Anyways, went there, and then had the two sandwiches. Delish. Fries were good. The burgers here taste so different than American burgers. I don't know how to explain it. Hey. They're just different. I don't know why. I feel like they taste like they have like. I thought they taste like they have like pork mixed in or something. Yeah, they're they're, they're different. They're different, but mm -hmm. we still ate it. It was pretty good. It was way better than the burger we had in Geneva that was horrible yeah I agree and the service there was amazing oh, huge bunch of bunch of tourists good spot yeah. yeah pretty chill and um well Matt got a couple of their beers I tried a couple of their sours and they were all good I was surprised to see sour beer because mm -hmm. I really like sour beer I don't like um I really don't love any beer that's not sour yeah so that was a treat and so I, last night when we were at funky chocolate I tried two other beers and I didn't like either of them. Mm -hmm. But then tonight, I gave it a third try, tried a different one, it was very good, so. Now, we're like gonna finish up our packing and we have to get up at six, cause we're, I don't hate going on the bus to train, to another train, to another train, cause we're going all the way down to Florence, Italy. Florence, Italy, yeah. So, it'll be we're a, excited it'll be for a, that. It'll be a long day. We're supposed, to, we're supposed to arrive in Florence at 2.30, so. It's a, like eight that, six hour, hours? Six, six hours, yeah. Six hour day of, of straight travel, so. So, that'll it, be fine. It'll though. be a haul. Um, we'll, we'll update you all when we get there. Also, Anyways. on the, wait, sorry. Oh, wait. go ahead. Also, so we have one, or I have one more beer to try. So it's Rugen Brau <laughs> Special. Um, I don't know, I found it up in Mirren um, when we were hiking around there yesterday so i don't know it's I, I, I like their traditional lager so this is their special beer so i'm gonna try go it, for it, it and for see it. how it is my last beer in switzerland go, go, go. i'll try it just for the video Ooh, it's good it's like happy but kind of like uh blondish as well <laughs> uh no i don't know not I, it for me it's sweet. good though i like it so now we're gonna fish packing shower get in bed Hope we fall asleep. We literally never fall asleep early here because we're like so thrown off with the time zone. Yeah. And I, we will, oh, what? Yeah, I haven't gotten more than like four or five hours to sleep a night. Typically I toss and turn till about 2 a.m. and then fall asleep till six <laughs> and wake up exhausted. So it's fun. <laughs> anyways, we will see you guys in Italy. So anyways. Th yeah, thanks for joining us along. Yeah. Uh, Switzerland, beautiful country, beautiful oh my gosh. place. We'll be back. Highly recommend it. And yeah, we'll uh, take you along to Italy. For sure. All right, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.